everyone, welcome to today's edition of This Is What Happened, But You Missed It Because You Weren't Here. So, I am really fed up with everyone talking crap about Sarah Palin, and in the spirit of Chris Crocker, who put it best, leave Sarah Palin alone! She doesn't deserve it! She didn't do anything wrong! Leave Sarah Palin alone! Yeah, so, notice... The blanket in the background. I didn't have anything to hang it from, so I'm holding it. But yeah, um, all jokes aside, I'm really, like, pissed off. Because it's really annoying when people, like, talk crap about her. But then they don't even, like, know anything about the situations. Like, I can guarantee you, like, you could ask so many people one of her, like, to name one of her policies or something. And they would have no idea. Because... They just jump on the bandwagon of what everyone else is saying. And they're like, oh, Sarah Palin, she's so stupid. Uh, her house is close to Russia. Uh. No, I'm tired of it. And I think America needs to wake up, be more aware of what's going on in the world, and not just listen to the liberal media anymore. Because Chris Matthews and um, Keith Oberman and Rachel Maddow, like, no. Okay? No. And if you're going to go and say that Fox News is all conservative and biased, MSNBC is just as biased on the other side. Okay. Thank you. You need to start watching, like, CNN or something if you're going to critique. Anyway, um, <laughs> I need to go write a psych paper, so I'm going to work on that, and I'm going to dry my hair. And, uh, yeah, leave Sarah Palin alone, because... She didn't do anything wrong. She doesn't deserve any crap. So, and if you are gonna, like, talk about her in a negative light, at least have facts to back it up. And, like, educated responses. Because I don't, I'm so tired of it. It's really annoying. And she's not a bad person. So, just cut it out. And that's all I have to say. <laughs> so, until next time, much love.